Hey folks, you're watching Jimmerism Compact Starmate Tutorial. Today we will look through the missile system often referred to as nukes. Begin with setting yourself up with a simple core with a power system. The main computer will be a missile computer. Keep in mind that you can have your orientation of your missile computer in any direction you want, but if you can't lock onto your target, you might want to consider having them facing forward. Spawn a missile computer, then spawn a pulse computer. Pulse computer will be what we use to lock on. Then we need the explosive effect computer. Select the missile computer by C hook up the pulse computer and explosive by clicking V. Nukes are extremely power hungry. In order to fire them from your ship you might need to have some power capacitors. A default core offers 50,000 energy by default and that is not enough to fire a 6 block nuke system. That will give you an idea of exactly how much power it takes. Now we will be constructing the nukes. Select the missile computer, spawn two missile modules. Then select the pulse computer and spawn two pulse modules. And lastly, do the same thing with the explosive effect modules and computers. Thus you have a simple nuke system. If you have less pulse modules per missile module, you will get a more of a heavy missile, a bit more faster loading and a bit less damage per missile. However, you like to keep the explosive to 100%, that is as many as the missile computers, because then you will get the maximum blast radius, which is very important for a nuke missile. Get into your ship and we will test off this nuke onto the Dragoon. And fire. And you see, even though it was a very small system, it did much damage to the shields. There are two ways to work with nukes. Either you have many smaller weapon groups, or you have a ridiculously large nuke. Now we will construct many smaller weapon groups, the same strategy I use for the logistic Neko uh, demolition nukes. Spawn missile modules in this manner and remember to keep them separated. This is crucial. Do the same with the rest of the modules. Remember to select the right computer. Now you can go into the ship and lock on the nukes. And we'll wait for the energy to reload. We can fire our next one. In this manner, we can keep firing nukes as long as we have a weapon group. And then we have a number of nukes we can fire until we need to reload. And this, this manner makes us create huge amounts of damage in a short amount of time until we need to reload all of them. And now for the more conventional nuke, one big enormous nuke system. In order to use that you will need an enormous power source, so be ready to spawn very many power capacitors. This should be enough. Then make your nuke system. Also, don't forget to take your missile computer and hook up a nice radioactive collar. Now let's test out the system by firing the Mega Nuke. And the damage is quite impressive considering we had to take out its shields first. The Nuke is the most heavy and sluggish weapon you can build in StarMade. I hope you will have fun with it and please keep in mind it's better suited for really big ships.
Thank you for watching StarMate Compact Tutorials with Gemidism out. Please leave a like if you enjoyed it. See you next time.